Hey my loves, I'm Elisa. Welcome to the Shameless Academy TV, where every week we bridge the gap between sexuality and spirituality and we answer some of our deepest questions with love. In this week's episode, guys, I want to share with you that one thing that I believe all of us should do before making love or having sex with our partners. It doesn't have to do with hygiene or contraception, but rather with preparing our soul for the deep, mind-blowing connection that's about to happen. So that one thing that I want you to consider doing before making love to your partner is making someone's day. Exactly. Make someone else's day. Like for example, if you're on your way back home and you know that your lover awaits for you to get all sweaty and naughty, make sure to stop, smile at someone, compliment someone, buy some food for homeless people, buy a flower and give it to an older lady. Do everything that makes you feel comfortable with it and at the same time leaves someone more hopeful about life and people in that day. And before saying anything, let me share with you the four magical things that happen when you make someone else day before making love. First, you crack your heart wide open. And there is no better state in which you can make love than this total openness. And generosity cracks our heart wide open faster than anything else. What we give, we gain. What we give, we gain. Giving isn't actually a selfless act. I want you to think about this. Because the ones who give receive back way more than the ones gifted. So don't think twice. Just give, baby. The second magical thing that happens is that you feel more deserving. You feel more deserving and you feel better about yourself as a human being. And this is huge because a lot of times we actually don't feel that we deserve. We may intellectually think that we deserve, but we don't feel it in our hearts. We don't believe it on a cellular level. So what we expect, we get, even when making love. It's our vibe that attracts our tribe, right? It's our vibe that attracts our partner. So put yourself out there, heal other people's hearts, and your heart will be taken care of nonetheless. The third magical thing that happens when you make someone else stay before you make love is that it helps put your life into perspective. And that helps you be more grateful with what you already have. And gratitude, we all know it, it opens our heart and it makes us more aware and in awe of our partner. Every time, but every time we interact with someone who has less than we have, we learn to laugh at our problems. And what other best ingredients you can add into making love other than presence and playfulness? Yes, presence and playfulness. That is what you get if you choose to make someone else stay before you make love. And being present and playful is the best gift that you can give to your lover. Believe me. And last but not least, the fourth magical thing that happens when you choose to make someone else stay before making love is that you will be showered in an abundance of blessings by the person that you have surprised and made happy earlier on. And those good vibes come from the most pure place in their heart and they will protect you and they will strengthen you. You'll see that. You'll feel that. You'll exude that. So this was my little insight for you this week, my loves. And I really wanted to do this video because I feel that we all go through a lot of things on a daily basis. Things that challenge us emotionally, physically, mentally. And sometimes we use intimacy to escape reality, right? And we start making love to heal ourselves. And when we do this, what happens is that we enter making love from a place of neediness. And while that is human, my deepest desire 
is that all of us start making love from a place of, of abundance and gratitude like gods do. Because when we do so, we learn to shift our attention from me to we, to become fully present and open, totally open towards the alchemy with our partner. Don't we all want this? My loves, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you liked it. And if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and let me know what you think about it in the comments below. Nonetheless, if you want more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel, The Shameless Academy. Follow me on Facebook for daily juicy insights. And if you want to become the best lover you can, sign up below for a private coaching session with me. Until next time, stay shameless and do your woman right. Exactly. Do her right.